Haggai 1 1 B. Today we're going to start uh, after the Athnach here. So we have Hayah Devar Adonai, Beyad Haggai Hanavi, El Zerubabel, Bein Shaeltiel, Pachat Yehuda, Ve El Yehoshua, Bein Yehot Sadak, Hakohen Hagadol, Lemor. For a translation today, we get this. The word of the Lord came by the hand of Haggai the prophet to Zerubbabel, son of Sheltiel, the governor of Judah, and to Joshua, son of Jehozadak, the, uh, the priest, the great one, or the great priest, saying. And what we have here uh, at the beginning is our verb with the call perfect 3ms of the root haya, and it came about, or and it came. The thing that came is the subject, the word of the Lord here. And the manner or the way that this word of the Lord came was by the hand of Haggai uh, the prophet. And it's interesting that the word of the Lord could come by the hand, but here we have something like a written oracle of Haggai or something of that nature. Notice here that the prophet is functioning appositionally to Haggai, further defining who he is. In the next prepositional phrases, we get uh, to whom the uh, message came. To Zerubbabel, son of Sheltiel, the governor of Judah. Here, the governor of Judah is further modifying, not Sheltiel, further modifying Zerubbabel. And then uh, to Joshua, son of Jehozadak, the high priest, or the great priest, further modifying Joshua. Now, the great priest here is an attributive adjective. Notice uh, it agrees in gender, number, and definiteness. So we literally get the priest, the great one, or the great priest. Finally here we have the infinitive construct, lemor, which is usually not parsed. It usually just indicates uh, the word saying and introduces direct speech.